My name is Ashok, I'm from Markham, Ontario, and I am in the Environment Resources and Sustainability Program with a specialization in environmental assessment and a minor in philosophy. I chose ERS because I believe that climate change is one of the most existential threats that our society faces, and for me, ERS allows you to tackle that issue from an interdisciplinary approach. So you'll see people from ERS all over the place in terms of analysts, policy analysts, economists, politicians, business owners. There's a lot of things you can do with ERS and it equips you with those tools because it allows you to learn both the technical skills from science and then it allows you to learn those uh, social skills like communication, leadership, and co-management. Choosing the University of Waterloo was not only great for my academic career but my personal development as well because it allowed me to gain some great co-op experiences. For example, my past one was at the RCMP. I also had the opportunity to go to COP24, the United Nations Climate Change Summit in Katowice, Poland. I've also had the opportunity to go to the Arctic as a field course, which is really great. And that's something the University of Waterloo provides students with. It's unique interdisciplinary opportunities to kind of step out of their comfort zones and challenge themselves in new environments. The name of the podcast is I Speak for the Trees. The whole purpose of it is to remove uh, political filters and academic jargon so that anyone can listen to the podcast and understand what environmental issues are arising and how they can take actions towards mitigating those problems in their everyday lives. It's about doing what you can and what you feel comfortable with so we can make that small gradual change and eventually have a culture shift where we can kind of live a more sustainable life without compromising our personal freedoms and personal comforts.